This is an updated video of our entertainment system at the Orange Beach Condo. Out in front of you there is our flat, scene, uh, flat screen television. Uh, below it is a Wally box that's got the, all of the cable TV channels on it. Uh, below that is the uh, DVD player and to the right is the internet uh, router. And right in front of me here are the three remote controls. I should arrange them in this order because that's how I want to talk about them. This one on the left controls only the television. And really I would not even have that remote included if it weren't for one button that's needed on here. Once you uh, get the television on, uh, this input button is pretty important uh, for switching between HDMI 1 and HDMI 2. Okay, um, HDMI 1 has the cable television on it. HDMI 2 has what makes that television smart, which is a Roku box. It's going to have, the, the Roku is going to have you know, Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, Amazon Prime. And if it doesn't have what you want, it's, you can uh, put the app on there that you need. So uh, let me go into a demonstration here. Uh, what I like to do is take this remote for the cable TV and use the uh, power button over here, the master power. And that should turn on both the... Uh, television and the cable TV and it'll take a minute and as soon as it gets booted up it should have a little message in the corner that said resuming session I guess we skipped that but here's uh, here's all our cable television so find your shows on there if that's not what you're looking for uh, you can switch over to uh, HDMI 2, which be, would be that Roku. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to hit input and flip that down to HDMI 2. And then I will hit the home button on the, the uh, Roku remote. Let's see if I can get focus. There's a home button on the upper right. I'm going to hit that, wake the Roku up. And there you go into the Roku menu. I can just sit there. Up here. And then you, you see uh, you recognizable apps there, which is the Netflix, Hulu, the Disney Plus, Disney Now, uh, ESPN. And let's say, you know, let's say you're a subscriber to, say, Peacock. All right. You can actually add channels and then come over here to channels that aren't on it. And if I want a Peacock on here, I could just install Peacock onto the Roku and I would have it. So that's what's cool about a Roku. And I think gives it a one up on say a smart TV is that they're typically faster than a smart TV and uh, they're always updating. That That is what Roku does is uh, these streaming services so I hope that's good hope you like it and if you got any questions just let me know